We're going to Ibiza this summer. I'll be a long time waiting on that one, so I will. When are you going to get yourself a proper job? I lent money from this Egypt from the Ukraine called Boris. Man. Who would have borrowed a fiver off that lad? He's a lunatic. He's a tit at school. He's a tit now. Are you going to look like competition tonight? I am. What is Axel Rose, man? Do you think I'm going to Chuck Norris? No. Do you go now? I'm gonna win we are through. I need that money. We've missed the last three repayments on this. We're repossessing the car. What's the house? Car? No worry. Got a couch here to sleep on it for as long as you want. Geez, my head is banging today, so it. The car and the woman gone in one night. I woke up this morning and think it was all one big nightmare. Jesus, will you cheer up, Eddie, right? First off, we've got the interview for the project manager. Yeah. And we're going to put down the deposit for Ibiza. Right. Yeah? Well, you're looking at the new project manager now. And that job is mine. As well as that job there is yours, man. <laughs> Find those old Egypts there now. That's nothing that a bar of soap or a washer wouldn't cure. This motorway is going through. Back in a few skulls. All right, man, yeah. Settle the nerves. Ah, yeah. Your interview. Listen, Eddie, I don't want to put you under pressure what with Nori in the Skyline and the job interview. There was some big Egypt here looking for you yesterday, right? Looked like he was a Norwegian, in the shape of a fridge. Oh, man. Yeah. I told him he ran over by a load of cattle and you're in intensive care. Did he believe you? Seemed to go for a chat, yeah. Hey, there's Toshin. Oh, there he is, man. What the hell is he doing on TV, man? Not a clue. Look at him there, hey. What's he doing there with the crusties? I think he's trying to stay in the straight and narrow detail. This is for you I to be on the door. Son. Why don't you go I down to the way now? And I... go down to the Spanish arch. Jesus. Oh, oh, man. Oh, fuck. The oh. camera's five inches high. Fair play, man. Eleven's been around since the year dot, like. You know, since Castletown was either a castle or a town or. Some kind of a thing like that. Sure, I got this golf course now, and has been in the family for yanks, you know, donkey's years. I tell you this though, there's nine holes here in this golf course, and these nine are mine. You fuck with my holes, and I'll fuck with yours. So you can put the bypass straight through the whole fucking lot. Doesn't mean that those beautiful apple trees left go. That's fine. They don't like apples anyway. Don't worry about them. When we start here, we make good progress. I need this project to work. Keep Namor from knocking on my door. You're no evil. See no evil. Just as long as you do it. We'll do it. We've a good team. We've a fantastic team. This job is only going to pay my bills, Mr. Levin. But it'll make you a very, very rich man. Yeah, sure, that's the pot calling the cat black now, Seamus. <laughs> well, I don't know. <laughs> Nothing better than I like to be bashed with oh, gravy. Oh, maybe, maybe. <laughs> it's on like Donkey Kong. <laughs> We'll be swimming in our own juices now. <laughs> and the pig's back now. All lathered in sauce. He's on the phone to Bugenhagen there, man, you know. He's on about this Zambezi Nights. It's an African-themed takeaway in the town. In the middle of a global recession, like, you know? You don't even know a thing about running a chipper van, let alone a restaurant. A sound out, Buzz. Well, I better rush off now. The Zambezi boys are in. Yeah, seriously, live from Mabasa. Okay, yeah. Well, te tell Eddie that we're all thinking of him in the, the skyline. All right, good luck. See you now. Well, as you heard, the Zambezi boys are in. It's all on. It's uh, myself and Kofi's latest business venture. I'm a girlfriend, and she is so blue. I've been saying it for years, what Castletown needs is a West African themed restaurant. Yesterday I spent the whole day coming up with a business plan, words and everything, the lot. The blueprints are good, but it needs a bit more work. That's the locals, nice little chaps. This is the food, all well done, well done all together. This is the best page, dollars and euros, you have to convert them. Lad smiling and profits done. 200 multiplied by 20. Well anyways lads, I have to cruise because uh, Businessman now, and it has to be all perfect. Myself and Kofi have to get this perfect. I don't know what Eddie and Buzz are doing, going for some shite interview. You have to be the captain of your own soul, not playing out to some other big boss man who doesn't have a clue. But I'm off now, boys. I'll see. Money is great. <laughs> <laughs> Just the way I live, Ma. Hey, crouching tiger, hidden nagging job. I have to beat the man seriously. I don't think you can get there without money. Oh no, why do you think I'm here, man? 
You're some country poo, you know what I mean? Um, Mr. Durkin? Yep. They're ready to see you now? Right, so. Good luck, fellas. All right, man. Wish me luck now. Good luck, man. Good luck, man. Green and red of mayo. Eddie Chalk. Got it, man, brother. Good to see you, good to see you. Amen. Handwritten CV there, personal touch. Thought you'd make a very good interest in reading now, so study that. Knock yourself out there, good man. I've interviewed you before, have I not? The face does look familiar, right? It does ring a bell. But you know, I mean, such high demand these days, it's hard to know who's who, like, you know? Hold on now, Seamus. We run a fair ship here. We'll give the lad in a crack of the whip. This should be quick. Good. Eddie, can you tell me please about your experience in the construction sector? <sighs> Where do I start? Since I was a kid, I was out in the building sites with the old lad, you know. Shuttering, hard carrying, fucking digging trenches, lock laying, mixing cement, roofing, tiling, chippy work, chasing walls. I'm jack of all trades, man, you know. And the master of any? Huh? Eddie, 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 look into my eyes. The position you're applying for here today, project manager. Yeah, the ganger man. Sure, we're digging the same trench here, fellas. I better let you go now. Good luck. That's coffee there now. Not a man for particulars. We're going into the restaurant business, and I've sewn it up nicely. He's in the guards as well, so if there's any bit of trouble, any bit of backward action with guards, I can sort that out. I'm going up now to the airport. Are you coming or what, what's the story? Mr. Durkin, what are your thoughts on value engineering in the construction sector, please? Valuable engineering? No. Value engineering in the construction sector. Good, yeah. Well, you know what? That would just about conclude our interview now, and thanks very much for your time, Mr. Durkin. Well, hang on a minute, like. No, I'm, I'm the best, man. I work circles around you. You haven't seen nothing like me. I'm, I'm serious, like. Go on. Look, I level with you, and I'll come clean. I lost me skyline, and I need this job. I just need to get away for a holiday and, you know, forget about everything, like. Just get away from it all. You go on a holiday to Ibiza, you know? I mean, if I don't, I'm just going to bust loose. Kill some mongs, like. Plenty now, Durkin. Um, he'll give you a call. You will, yeah? You got the mobile number, have you? you? I'll get my people to talk to your people, Mr. Durkin. We're looking forward to hearing from you, like. Cool, man. Thank you very much. Good to meet you, Seamus. Aloysius, man. Good to see you. And, uh, little look forward to getting the job, hopefully. Well, your man was a bollocks. There was no crack out of them at all. A typical dry balls. But I do, however, think that the no-nonsense approach may have paid off. How are you women? Billy. What's the game? The game? Yeah, the crack in her act, like. Sorry? How many can you? How are you keeping? Very well, Mr. McDonald. Good man. Can you tell me, do you know the guy that was just in here before you? Uh, no. no. Well, that's very strange. According to your CVs, you didn't the same address. Oh, I didn't know what you meant by gnome. I, I know him to see like, but you see, we wouldn't talk because we live in the opposite sides of the cottage. I see. No. Yeah. So, any questions? Any questions? Yes. Okay, Mr. McDonald, can you tell me please what you know about value engineering in the construction sector? Yes. You can? Oh, yeah. Well, you know, I think this will conclude our interview. Thank you very much for your time, Mr. McDonald. Are you Mr. joking McDonald. me? I'm only in the fucking door. How'd you go on, Buzz? Not a damn chance. I was a bit too cute when I went in first and they didn't like me joke, so... Come on. Excuse me, Mr. Durkin. How are you getting on? Hi. Hey. Did I get into the second round, or is this not a work-related inquiry? Um, no, there's actually a gentleman in the bar looking for you. Oh, yeah? Yeah, and um, he seems to have a funny accent. Oh, no, no, no. Look after them, will you? Come on. Who's that? It doesn't matter, man. Just get the fuck out of here now. If you could describe yourself in four words, what would they be? Well, I don't know after this interview. 
probably unemployed. On the door. God, man, this is depressing. Well, at least it's not raining, man. Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, Dirk it! What's the crack? Fuck on, will you know, you fucking soft yeah. fuck, yeah? Listen up to this, hey. Be here at three o'clock, yeah? I've got a surprise for you. Oh, yeah, what's that, man? You're selling drugs to kids as usual, yeah? Even Big better man. than that, dick lips. Three o'clock, right here. Slide on now. I don't know what he means by that, man. He's like some type of white cat they never had at home. Yeah, he was never spared either. No. Come on, let's put this deposit money on. Yeah. Holiday time. So, we give you that 50 between us, you keep that noted, we'll come back tomorrow with another 50, and as a personal deposit, I give me one third three ten. You cannot say any fairer than that, like. Lads, the deposit is 100 euros. I really can't keep repeating myself like this. Look, I know you're doing your job, right? But we've been not in the fucking sound to you since coming in here. Will you throw us a bone, like? It's the wrong time you're wasting. Meh, meh. Come here, boys. Operation Signal has me so excited. A shot of piss just ran down my leg. Where's Dirk, man? I haven't got a clue. That Klim needs to be here, man. It's crucial. Got the walkies ready, yeah? Good job. Stay outside. You sound? Do I stand here? No, man. You stand 20 miles down the road in Tubber Quack. Of course you stand here, man. Smoke machine? So sorry. Good job. Want that thing billowing out smoke like a fucking genie. It's crucial to the illusion, right? Crucial to the illusion. What's my walkie-talkie? Gotta walk your way up. General Gala. Hi, lads. How are we giving? How's the boys? Come back to get a can of druids and a little curly whirly back in a minute. Give me a pack of hot lips, will you? Sound. How'd it go with the travel agents? Not good, man. Didn't have the money, like, you know. I offered the 5610 knock you. No good. She wouldn't take it. So, uh, looks like she's put the kibosh on it now. So, what am I going to do? Press the button, man. There's nothing to it. The monkey can do it. What the fuck? All you have to do Where is press the red car? button. Nothing else. Tell me you've got it. Come out. Yeah. Repeat. I've got it. Goodbye. I wasn't even worried about that interview, man. It was simple. Eddie, man. Story, boys. What are you at? Come quick. Your mother said you wanted. Oh, fuck that shit, man. I'm going to see what this prick is up to. It's nearly three o'clock, man. Yeah, but she's in trouble, man. I mean she's in trouble? Yeah, she's been um, attacked by a load of badges up in the woods. What the fuck she's doing with the woods, man? I don't know, man, but them fuckers carry TB. Trevor Brennan. Come on. Fuck me, man. Sky boy. Sky boy. Sky boy.